good shot. <gasps> well, 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 if it ain't a bunch of little kids. What you doing, little kids? Playing with marbles? <laughs> hey, Chuckle, this one's a stealing. A stealing, huh? Well, that's a different story. Take them, boys. Hey, leave those kids alone. Oh, yeah? And, and what if I don't? If you don't, it'll be just like last time and the time before that. And you remember what happened then, don't you, Chuckle? This isn't over, Vince! My big brother size in eighth grade. When I tell him what you did, he's gonna get you good! Ooh, I'm quivering in my high tops. Okay, okay, that's enough. You're welcome. Yeah, yeah, you're welcome. Did you see that? Did you? Wow, Vince, that was the coolest thing I've ever seen. Ah, that was nothing. Nothing? Vince, you just faced down Chuckle, the meanest fifth grader on the whole playground. If that's not cool, I don't know what is. Yeah, Vince is so cool, every kid on the playground wants to hang with him. What? Oh, that's ridiculous. Hey, Vince, want to hang with us? Vince is so cool. Kids of every grade worship him like a god. What? Oh, man, why do you guys get this stuff? Oh, mighty Vince, we offer up to you our two front teeth worth 50 cents street value. Face it, Vince, there's nobody cooler than you. Oh, yeah? What about Chad? Oh, yeah, Chad. Good boy. Who's Chad? My big brother. Chad's the coolest guy this school's ever known. I remember once when I was in kindergarten. I was all alone in the sandbox, and Chad came over and played with me. Yeah, and back in first grade when I got that bean stuck up my nose, Chad showed me how to blow it out. Chad was cool, all right. Man, I haven't seen him for years. Well, it just so happens my big brother Chad's gonna pick me up after school today. Wow, really? Yeah, and if you guys play your cards right, you just might get a chance to see him again. You hear that? This is Big Brother Chad is coming by after school. He gave me my first shovel. Come on, let's dig in a really big hole. Guess what I just heard? Chad is coming. He'll be here after school. Chad? I remember him from when I was in first grade. Oh, what a hunk. Yeah, he had those dreamy permanent teeth. <sighs> I remember once when I was a mere fourth grader, Chad actually spoke to me. And it was at that moment I knew that one day I, Bob, would be king. <sighs> I wonder why all these kids are here. Who knows? Must be some sort of celebrity. So, Vince, what's Chad up to now? Huh? You're all here to see Chad? Yeah! You think he'd sign my shovel? Tell us, Vince, is he still cute? We haven't seen him, like, forever. Well, uh, he's pretty much the same as always. He just got a really cool bike. Cause that Chad got a new bike! Probably a mountain bike! Or a motorcycle! Yeah! Hey, everybody! Chad's riding a chopper! <laughs> there he is now! Hey, Chad! <gasps> Chad! Chad! Nice hog. Hog? No, not him. Him. Hey, Vinny, come on. I'm going to be late for chess club. Coming, Chad. See you later, guys. I got to go hang with my cool big brother, Chad. That's Chad? He seems so much bigger before. And so much cooler, too. Why, he's nothing but a nerd. Oh, I'm so depressed. Actually, when you think about it, it all makes sense. I mean, what self-respecting fifth grader would want to hang out with us when we were in kindergarten? Sure, he seemed like the uber Chad back then, but now... He's a total dork! Poor Vince, he doesn't even know. Yeah, I think he was gonna take it when he finds out. <laughs> Chad, a geek? <laughs> That's rich. That's really rich. Vince, take it from someone who knows. Your brother is definitely a geek. Come on, Chad's way cool. He can burn the whole alphabet. Look, Vince, what's the thing your brother wears in his pocket? Pocket protector? He doesn't want to get ink on his shirt. Okay, then. What's that stuff he wraps around his glasses? Tape. They break all the time. That's kind of a classic sign. Well, you break your glasses, too, if you have baseball trying at you at top speed. You mean Chad's on the baseball team? Sure, he's the greatest scorekeeper they ever had. I rest my case. Oh, come on, you guys. My big brother Chad is not a geek. I'll see you guys later. I gotta go pick up Chad's turtle from the vet. Stage one, denial. What's that stuff he wraps around his glasses? Take it's kind of a classic side. was really neat. We're studying the life cycle of the Colombian tree toad. Someday I'd like to live among them and learn their peaceful ways. <coughs> and after chess club, the guys and I went down to Compu Hut and watched them unpack the latest mouse pads. They're really neat, though. <coughs> Whoopsie daisy. <coughs> It's 
Is it something I said? Oh, brother. Enter, if you dare. Hey, Vince, check it out. I just beat myself at three-dimensional chess. Chad, can we talk? Sure, what's on your mind? I really don't know how to say this, but I've just been noticing that... Well, that you're a geek. Yeah, so? You mean you know you're a geek? Oh, sure. Ever since first grade when I bought my pet earthworm to show and tell and everybody laughed. But I always thought you were so cool. You have all these CDs and... Geek music. Andrew Lloyd Webber, Sondheim, Gilbert and Sullivan. But you always did cool stuff. And you always knew everything. And you always... Sorry, Vince, but I am what I am. And the fact is, I'm a geek. Ooh, here comes Freddy's message. Hey, can we talk later, Vince? We started our own chat room. <laughs> Neato, huh? <laughs> Hey, come on, Vince. It's not the end of the world. But Chad's a geek. Big deal. He's still your brother. I know, I know. It's just all these years I thought Chad was so cool. And now that I know he's not, it just makes me question everything. I mean, heck, if he's a geek, maybe I'm a geek. Maybe my whole life's been a sham. Oh, come on, Vince. You're talking crazy. Am I? I can see it all now. It'll start small. One of these days, I'll be walking along, minding my own business, and something will catch my eye. Soon I'll be having strange cravings for polyester pants and orthopedic shoes. Saying words like whoopsie daisy and Nino. Before you know it, I'll be playing cauldrons and caverns, learning stupid yo-yo tricks, and sneaking into sci-fi conventions in my spare time. And then one night, when the moon is full... And that's not the way things are going to be. Maybe and maybe not. But if this geek thing's hereditary, then I'm a walking time bomb. <sighs> Man, things can't get any worse than this. That's the kid's side. The guy in front of thinks he's so cool. So, you've been giving my little brother a hard time, eh? Hey, look, I think this is just a big misunderstanding. Yeah, you misunderstanding that you do not mess with the Kowalski family. Ever! Ooh. Hey! Leave those kids alone. Save yourself, Chad. I can only hold him back so long. It's okay, Vince. I can handle it. Stay out of this decoyter. You're next. You heard me, Cy. Leave those kids alone. And if I don't? If you don't, you can just forget about me helping you with your math homework anymore. But, well, we're starting algebra soon. Don't take that from him, Cy. He's just a big geek. Shut up, Chucko. This guy's not kidding around. Look, Chad, we're sorry. It was just a, a, a big misunderstanding. We didn't mean nothing bad. Honest. Yeah! Chad, that was so cool. Hey, just because I'm a geek doesn't mean I'm not a cool geek. Come on, I'll give you a ride home in the old Chadmobile. See you later, guys. I'm going home with my big brother, Chad. Hey, Chad, do that thing you do. Oh, okay. A, B, C.